Good afternoon, YouTubers. Weedle Whisperer here today. Uh, I wanted to do a review on the Shimano AM5 shoe. Uh, in my previous reviews for the Canon Hill Slate when I first started riding it, uh, I said I was going to do a review on uh, the AM5 Shimano shoes. Uh, I kind of wanted to touch base with them. So far, I got about 190, 200 miles. It is winter time here in Pennsylvania, so it's uh, tough to ride right now. I'm still trying to gather up some cold weather gear. Uh, from previous statements, you know, I was a uh, it was a Bianchi road bike rider for since pretty much I came out of the womb. They handed me a Bianchi as soon as I was born, and I rode a Bianchi all the way up to about a month and a half ago. And I can't say that uh, I'm disappointed at all. Cannondale Slate uh, has done an amazing job with the 105 that I currently have, and I really enjoy riding now. I was just out riding it today. But that's not about the Cannondale Slate. This is about the AM, uh, AM5 Shimano shoes. So when I first opened them up, uh, you know, being a roadie, I guess you want to call it, I, I, I felt that they were kind of heavy. But uh, once I put them on, I wear a 42, uh, eight and a half in men's. Perfect shoe fit, perfect, uh, really perfect the way it fits around my foot. Again, was used to road shoes, tight, lightweight, all that stuff, but being that I'm on the trails more now, uh, I had to pick a more sturdier shoe to walk on. Uh, stiff, good ankle support. It actually has a strap to, uh, you know, basically put your laces away and hide them so they don't get uh, caught up in any of your chain or whatnot. Good Velcro system, very stiff shoe. Uh, it's, it's very, for the extent of being so stiff, it's still very pliable. There's only one thing that I don't like out of the whole thing in this shoe, and that's the cleat system. Cleat system is great, um, but what happens is every once in a while when you're on the trails and you get off, a pebble or something will get stuck in there, so you'll have to like kind of pry it out. Uh, I don't know if that's a design flaw or is that everything is people are used to it and whatnot, but really um, the shoe is pretty awesome. Seems to have held up pretty well. It gives me good flexibility on the rides. Like I said, I probably got about a hundred and uh, it's probably let's just say 200 miles on it right now. I'll probably do another one in the summer. As far as coldness, uh, I've been riding anywhere between 35. Uh, 30, 35, and 40 degrees, and the foot stays relatively warm, except for right here where the tip is at. The air breathing on the front side of it moves some air through there, and you can actually feel it while you're pedaling. So good thing for the summertime, but somewhat bad for the wintertime. I don't have winter socks, so I'm running around with summer socks at the moment, and uh, you know, doing what I can do to, to get my gear back into, back into um, working condition, basically, to, to be able to pedal out in the, in the wintertime. All in all, Shimano did a great job. I picked the green just because I have a Cannondale Slate 105 that's green, kind of matched the bike. Super pleased with the shoe. Uh, I, cannot ha I don't have any complaints other than the pebbles getting stuck in there, which I'm sure any other shoe will probably have the same concept if you're doing trail riding and whatnot. Grip is very good. Uh, I didn't slip and fall today. I was in the ice and snow, so it held up very well. The traction on them are good. Uh, walking into stores, you know, getting a Gatorade, something like that nature. You know, the treads on them are very good. Uh, you don't hear the cleat at the bottom of it. It actually works very well and is a very enjoyable shoe to even walk uh, in and out. Uh, if I had to give them a rating out of one to five, I'd probably get about four and a half. And the only reason why I'm really giving it any half off is because being clipped in, sometimes it gets annoying to try to figure out if you have a, a, a piece of pebble or stone or something caught up in that cleat. Again, um, great shoe, Shimano AM5s. If you like it, uh, if you like this video, please uh, hit the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up. I'll be doing more on the Cannondale Slate as I go along, and I really enjoy it. So um, with that said, AM5, four and a half stars, keep riding.